We are out here on the Lakeside Renovation and Design Weather Deck. I am with Heather Freed, and uh, Heather is the president and CEO of Big Brothers and Big Sisters of Southwestern Illinois. And uh, I'm, I'm assuming that you need to get some folks to volunteer. The pandemic has taken uh, kind of a negative effect on, on the numbers of people. Absolutely. Um, the pandemic has caused a lot of hesitancy um, across the board, but the reality is that um, mentoring is safe, just like everything else is these days. You can do Zoom calls and, and now you can connect with the kid over your phone, online, and so we've made it safe and easy. And it's very important for some of these kids, you know, because they've had more free time than they've ever had before when they could have been with a big brother or big sister. Absolutely. Um, I think how children spend their time is a critically important, just the way how we spend our time is very important. And so when we can connect kids with uh, mentors and give them a positive outlet, we can really start to kind of change the tra trajectory of, of perhaps where their life could go. Yeah, I interviewed an alderman in the city of St. Louis, Joe Vaccaro, and uh, he's a big brother, was. And the impact that he had on this young man's life, who's now in the Navy, and the impact that it had on his life, you hear stories like this all the time on how it transforms people. Absolutely. We talk all the time about how um, our littles' lives are impacted, and they certainly are. I mean, 100% of our kids last year graduated high school. That's incredible. That is good. Um, but we also hear from our bigs, too, that they never anticipated that this was going to be something that changed their life. And so one of the sayings we say at Big Brothers Big Sisters is you're not only going to change one life, but you're going to change two. You usually get more women than men, don't you? Yes. <laughs> yeah. So and right now you really need more men to... to jump up and get in there. Absolutely. So the campaign that we're doing um, through the remainder of the year, we're trying to drive about 75 new male uh, applicants to our website. Um, the campaign's called Real Men Mentor. It's intended to be tongue in cheek and we are wanting men to step up. We want them to get off the sidelines and to get into the game. And um, you know, I think after the year we had, people are looking to have fun again. People are looking for a way to make a positive impact on their community and have some sense of control in their lives. Some people are worried about cost, but I mean, this is this is about time. Right. Spending time, not spending a lot of money on stuff, but just spending time and mentoring. Absolutely. The, there's really no cost. Um, there's a lot of free um, and reduced fee activities you can do with your little. And as an agency, we really um, value making that available. Um, it's about time. It's about four hours a month is what we require for our commitments for a minimum of a year. You got to be 18. You have to have a valid driver's license. Absolutely. And you fully vet these people as well. Yes. We at Big Brothers Big Sisters uh, have the gold standard in safety. Um, we do background checks. We do interviews. We do reference checks. Um, but the process itself is actually pretty smooth and, and easy and quick. And you represent St. Clair County and also Madison County, Illinois? Yeah, and as well as Clinton and Monroe County. Clinton counties. and Monroe. And so, but, but you could live in Missouri and cross the bridge and, and mentor there. Well, the wonderful part about Big Brothers Big Sisters is there's affiliate agencies all over the country. And mm -hmm. so there's actually one on the Missouri side too, right. um, you know, southeastern Missouri. So do you want the volunteers to come from Illinois? For, for us, yes, we okay. need our volunteers no, to no. come from Illinois. But if you're listening to this and you live in Missouri, uh, our, I'm sure the Big Brothers, Big Sisters of Southeastern um, Missouri could use some, some male mentors as well. <laughs> Heather Freed, she's the president and CEO.